What is up, you guys? Team Respawn View. What's up to you, too, APL? Hey, what's up, man? I'm glad My you're back. Mr. Sark. I'm yep. APL. And, uh, yeah, and I'm, uh, I'm back. I've been sick, and it sucked. It has I absolutely can imagine. sucked. I've got the, uh, I've, I fell prey to that flu that is spreading across the United States of America. Um, and it was no good. I never really equated, though, and maybe this is sort of, uh, I don't know. Maybe this is really out of touch, but I never okay. equated flu with, like, chest congestion. No. Flu was always, like, nausea and, and fever vomiting. vomiting. Yeah. Yeah. But but this flu they're talking about is this whole sore throat, glands swollen, and there's like runny nose, coughing, flim flimming. That's not a flu, my friend. That's a cold, and I yeah. think the medical mu community is mislabeling it. <laughs> I think it's their fault. It's not our fault. We were brought up to think that's a cold. I mean, yeah. Geez. So I mean, that's what I've had. They're saying it's a flu, mm. but I've just had a fucking. What have you been doing? If you just rest in and like you, you take it. Dude, I didn't go outside or? for four for like four days. Mm. I feel like I'm just emerging from a long tunnel like I came out to the, my car to come to work today and was like oh my god it's so bright <laughs> but so refreshing and beautiful uh, yeah I'm in that whole like the world's such a lovely place and right. I have new appreciation for it phase of coming out of Vix <laughs> after you've been locked up for four days Vix everything looks sick. great jeez uh, yeah sucked it absolutely sucked I didn't even play games because you don't even have the on top of us being in our, uh, you know, hopefully just emerging from our little slump. Uh, ah, that God, looks good that, to me. That God looks good. Damn it. That looks By good. the way, we should, before we go on, we yeah, should yeah. introduce, like, we're, this is some B BLR. Uh, most of you guys know this is one of my favorite games of 2012. And I'm still playing it, and fuck the police. That's right. In this uh, gameplay, I'm running with the AMR. It's called an uh, anti-material rifle, which is technically what a Barrett is in real life. And it does what a bear does in real life. If you actually hit somebody with it, they will die. Just like Sergeant Razor just learned right there. Yeah. However, it has a god awful reload time, and the scoping in is enough to make you actually vomit because it is so slow. So, but it's fun to uh, it's fun to try and get good scores with. This game's not like that epic, but mm. people are so sad when they get shot with it, and they're like, "You fucking amateur!" <laughs> but then at the end of the day, there's just it's. Not the most efficient right. way to Why would you use this so. over an assault rifle or LMG? Everything's so, yeah, everything is so accurate and the damage is so good on a lot of these guns, but whatever. It's fun. It's entertaining and it sounds like goddamn Zeus has just opened up his fly and pissed out a lightning <laughs> bolt on you when you fire. <laughs> opened his fly. Uh, God, yeah, he's in, pissing in on Zeus you. Zeus wore blue jeans. R. Kelly. Actually, <laughs> R. Kelly Zeus. lightning bolts came out of his dick. <laughs> Then that is exactly what it's like. Okay. Um, no, but I thought we would talk a little bit about being sick. Mm, yeah. Uh, the, right now and uh, in the past. Here, okay. Oh, here's a here's a display of shooting completely shooting everywhere except the enemy. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That was kind of like a yeah, perfect pattern all the way around him. Look at that dude's like surprised. He's like, "What was that? What the hell? I just got attacked by a flying <laughs> muzzle flash." You were um, you were warning him. Those were warning. Yeah, shots. what's the sickest you've ever been? Oh man, the sickest I've ever been. Uh, I do. I was probably uh, I got something called dengue fever. I don't know if you've heard Whoa. of it, which is a kind of a tropical disease. Uh, I don't know if I've ever have I have I said that I've lived overseas on this channel yet. I don't know if we talked about it. I know you know briefly. But yeah. for for a, for about four years of my life, I lived in uh, South America because my because my parents' jobs. And, uh, yeah, so there, that's one you catch from a mosquito, basically, if you get bit by it. The dengue fever? The dengue fever. Okay. Yeah, and it's really, you can die from it if you're cared for. Um, it's, it's you know, you have a better chance of survival. But it's a pretty serious, uh, once you get it, it's bad, like super high fever, like 106, 107 oh, shit. for days. You have to wait for that to break. Yeah. So, actually, all three, uh, my brother, my sister, and I all got it at the same time. My mom was, like, beside herself. She was like... Because we were in a country that was not exactly known for its medical care. Yeah. So she was kind of just, you know, uh, house nursing us back to health and just hoping that we wouldn't die, essentially. So you guys were all sort of like, so we were, you were all sort of like in the in a, in a din gay club. You were we a were in a gay de, club. We were in a, pretty much in a gay club the, for were, about three yeah. days. You guys all lined and up and hopped into the din gay club. <laughs> we did. That's uh, Yeah, that's basically what happened. And we just basically, 
you just have no, you basically sleep. It's not even that bad. I mean, your whole body aches. You have just this insane yeah. fever. And I just, I, I basically don't know. I blacked out for about four days. And basically, I just remember coming too. Really? Like on day four and, and it broke. Ooh, it was like a shit. weird. Dude, you don't fuck with the tropics. No, you dude. You don't the screw around. Mosquitoes and those kind of diseases they carry are nothing to the fuck jungle with. jungle so. will, will own you. It will. What about you? What have the you. The sickest uh, I've been, and this will be, I, I've at this point, I've turned this into a funny story, but it was anything but okay. at the time. Okay. Uh, the sickest I've been was actually a case of food poisoning, which Ooh. I don't know if that counts as ill. Oh, are but, you kidding me? Food poisoning is uh, awful. Yeah, I was at uh, I was at my friend's wedding, and there was the you know the classic what do you want to eat? In this case, it was the fish or the chicken. Oh no! Right? Um, I went with the chicken, and uh, should have gone with the fish. Should have gone with the fish because here's what happens: I get home. I live in a, at this point. I'm in a tiny studio uh, in in Hollywood, and I get home. My stomach is boiling, and I'm like, "Oh my god, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start shitting." Is oh what god. it felt like. It was oh like god. deep stomach, not like throat, right? Right. I'm like, "Oh boy, this is not agreeing with me." Mm. So I get, I get down to business. I'm on the, uh, I'm on the pot, and I'm like, "Oh no!" And I'm, uh, I'm going like just, just, just it's <laughs> like a faucet, yeah. Uh, but it was this level of sort of sort of Rhea that will uh, start to fuck with your actual stomach. Yeah, so I start yeah. to feel like, oh, oh shit, no. I'm going to start vomiting. And I start looking around, like, for a trash can or something, because now I'm sitting on the, the shitter, and, and the, the, the poops are starting to wrap up. I'm like, oh, this is good, this is good. So... Uh, the trash can's not within reach. I'm afraid if I get up, I'm gonna oh, cause a no. cause like a mess. So I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna try and pinch it off, right, and spin around. And as oh. awful as it is, I'm gonna try and hurl into my diarrhea-filled <laughs> oh, toilet. No. I'm sorry if this is too graphic, oh, but this God. is a fucking true story, and it deserves to be heard. <laughs> I haven't even eaten it's lunch yet, dude. <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right, continue, continue. I hop up. I'm like, here we go. The time is now. Tried for a no scope right there. I hop up, and spin around, face in, and I'm like, oh. And if the, if I wasn't ready to puke, I was well, suddenly ready. All of course. Yeah. I start vomiting, and my body just—I'm just gonna tell you—my body just lets go. Like the of the, 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 the <laughs> just the whole the whole scene just screams to my body. You've got to just let this all happen. So I start spraying shit out of my ass no. onto the wall, no, onto no. the and the wall and the floor, and I'm I'm hurling and screaming, and and the, the <laughs> that's the worst. And I know I know what's happening, but I'm like embracing it because I'm like just get it out, just get it out. Oh my god! And uh, what was really funny to me was in the middle of this, and it just sounds like. <laughs> Like Chewbacca dying. <laughs> is is uh oh somebody god, in the man. parking lot outside goes Oh god. You okay, buddy? Like <laughs> 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 they, <shot> it. <laughs> uh, they must have thought I was being Yeah, being, like you're being murdered. Uh, oh god. my god, yeah. Man. That that was the most That's intense. Awful. I literally started to get uh like I started to like Lose consciousness, like the tunnel vision yeah, started it was, coming in. Yeah, that's and it. then it happened in a smaller way. It happened sort of again very recently. I hadn't eaten Taco Bell in a long time. Went oh, back to Taco God. Bell, and that went through me like, like nothing. Like I didn't have like you uh, didn't even digest it. No, just, like I didn't have a digestive tract. My esophagus just went straight to my bunghole, <laughs> <laughs> and I actually started to black out. I was <laughs> crapping so hard, and I'm like, dude, what the fuck? So no more that's Taco like, Bell for you? No, never, never. Oh man, that's rough. Well, that only took what six minutes for me to tell that oh awful God. story. Oh wow. You know, I guess next time the the keys for that are that you probably obviously you couldn't have known that was going to happen, but maybe just lying in the bathtub while you shit and vomit because <laughs> yeah. then you can at least run the water. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's all liquid anyway. Ugh, so jeez, it was terrible. Wow, that's that's awful. I'm well, sorry you had to go through that. I'm glad that that is not what I was sick with, yeah. and uh, I'm glad to be back. Good job, by the way. Oh, uh, yeah. And, uh, while I was away, I, we shoot. We have a very specific shoot schedule we try and adhere to, and uh, I know I'm looking forward to next week's inbox. And uh, uh, yeah, we had Borif on. Oh, we had Borif, and we had some laughs. I think it hopefully it came up. It, 
came out. It came out pretty good. All right, so, all right. So. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Good job. Uh, you guys rock. I hope all of you out there are not getting sick. And uh, we will talk to you tomorrow. See you guys later. We did the black screen thing again, by the way. Yep, whatever. That's our thing, man. All right. Yeah. Anything else you want to get out while we're on the black screen? Uh, That's not diarrhea. No, we talked all. Yeah. (laughs) There was enough getting out done on this commentary. (laughs) All right. Warning. Ensure protective masks are worn during this process as the gas is highly hallucinogenic. It's getting sexually tense in here.